Hey guys, it's Rio, and this is 30 Bags and 30 Days Challenge. This is day one. Um, I'm planning on going through the kitchen area. Um, if you don't know what 30 Bags and 30 Days is, is every day you go throughout your entire area, your room, your your uh, house, um, and you take a bag and you fill it up with things you want to just get out of the house. Um, I was inspired by just the art of decluttering. I was going to do a video and like try to come up with my own system and I just didn't feel like doing all that and the 30 bags and 30 days challenge is just super easy. It's, it's, it's just a little bag every day. You can just go through like 5-10 minutes um, in a pick area around your house and just declutter and get rid of everything that you're not using. Um, either it's trash or donate or um, give to a friend, whatever, just get it out of your house. Um, I really, really like this system. Um, this is the first time that I'm doing it, but I did watch a couple of YouTubers do it. I think they did it last year in April, so I wanted to do it again in April, kind of to like, um, I guess, I don't know, lay tribute to that? I don't know. Um, I saw them do it last, well not last year, but I've been like recently watching them. Um, this year, so I'm kind of late, so I just thought that I would go through and do it. Um, yeah, so this entire month is going to be 30 Bags and 30 Days Challenge. Um, I'm not sure I'm going to do other videos in this channel. Um, my other channels are still going to get love, it's just this channel, I'm not sure what's going to happen. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to go and go through this entire kitchen and hopefully we get a bag um, done today. So let's get started. Okay, so first I'm going to be going through each one of these. I don't think I have much to get rid of except for the third drawer um, in this section, so let's just get to it. Okay, so for the first drawer so far, all that I see is I'm not going to get any rid of anything except for these two spoons. They're really, really tiny, and I just... I don't really need them. Alright, in the second drawer, I'm just going to be getting rid of these two bag clips. They don't really work very well, so that's gone. Um, for the third one, I'm just going to take everything out and go through them individually, because that's definitely my messiest drawer in the kitchen. I do not like the way it's set up. Hopefully I will come up with a better organizing system. I just haven't really gotten the time to go through it yet and work on that. So let's just pull everything out. Alright, um, these I'm going to be keeping because I, we got these for our wedding and at our wedding. So these go inside. These we use quite often. This one I never use, so this goes away. These we already have serving spoons, so these go away. This I got the Dollar Tree, we don't use it. It's another server. We actually use these. Um, this one we bought when we first moved here and we couldn't find our um, scoop. Um, we got one because, I don't know, it was like 88 cents. But, like, right after we found it, or right after we bought it, we found our two scoops, so this one goes. This is for our mixer. It stays. It's for our rice cooker. It stays. These I need, potato washer, ladle, and this one, until we get one, a different one, uh, this is just going to have to do, I think I got this at the Dollar Tree. Okay, yeah, that's pretty much everything, the last drawer is just, um, like Tupperware, and I go through that regularly, so we're not going to do anything about that. Moving on, um, this one is fairly organized, it just has my 
oven mitts here and then stuff for the um, microwave that stays um, in there. It looks a little messy, but that all that we use every bit of that, so that stays. Okay, now we're going to be taking. I'm going to take some stuff off of from where they are and put it here, and then go through it. Um, so this I'm keeping. I haven't used it yet, um, but I got this last year, and I'm hoping to use this next Christmas. This is some gingerbread karate cakes um, and a couple of where's the other one? Gingerbread um, cookie cutters. So I'm keeping those because we make gingerbread. Well, we try to make gingerbread cookies every single year. Um, this is when we carve pumpkins. Um, these usually come, I don't know, I think I'm going to keep these. I think I'm keeping all this stuff, I'm sorry. I'm not off to a very good start. was a bust. Okay, these two containers were on the top of the fridge, um, and they're just empty containers, so I think I'm going to be getting rid of them because we're not using them. Okay. Um, I use this regularly, um, so I'm going to be keeping this. This two coffee mugs we use. This is an attachment to my um, shaker. This actually should be with my shaker. I like this one the most, so I'm going to be getting rid of these two from the Dollar Tree. I liked them. It's just that this is, I don't know, I think I might, I'm going to be keeping this one, the orange one. I'm going to get rid of the blue one. I don't need a more um, infused tumblers. And this is one of the ones but the top and the uh, thing broke. So these two stay. This one I think I'm going to get rid of. It's a little bit warped um, and yeah, so I'm going to get rid of this one. And then these three we use. Um, these keep like fruit and stuff chilled when we take um, lunches to work. Okay, next we're going to be tackling this sink, or not the sink, this cabinet above the sink here. Um, yeah, it's kind of full of bakeware, so we're just going to tackle this. I'm not sure how much I'm going to get rid of, but um, we're just going to go through it. Okay, um, let's just start from this side and then work our way this way. Um, let's open that a little bit more so you can see. Okay, this one we use quite regularly, so we're keeping this. This one, I don't really have a want to use this again, um, so I'm going to be getting rid of this one. Get all of the parts. So I'm getting rid of this. Okay. Um, this one I kind of want to keep because I haven't used it yet, and um, I really want to use it, so I'm going to keep that. These two were ke I'm keeping. Um, it just makes sense to keep. I like these two Tupperware here, so I'm keeping that. I'm keeping these because we actually use these a lot. Cupcake liners. I actually can go and consolidate and put it in here. I'm 
So, um, of course, we're keeping this one. These two we don't use that often anymore, but I like to have the circular pins just in case. These we use a lot. Um, they're corning wear. So I'm just going to see if they fit. Yes, they do. Right here. Keep them out of the way. That looks a lot better. Um, I didn't really get a lot of rid of a lot, but I did get enough so it's a little bit more comfortable in here. Um, we don't have a big kitchen, so um, we use pretty much every single spot that we can. I'm also sorry for the mess. I've been kind of cleaning and rearranging, so our bar area is kind of like wonky right now. Okay, and that is everything. I have my bag filled, and so I just need to put everything in their appropriate spots. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.